1.8. Fine instruction will break, break the speed, speed record at 100 miles an hour and it still holds that speed record from 2004. Uh, from Plymouth to London. I guess in Plymouth would be, I mean, not original planned in from Plymouth, I guess. It would be NER. It's now from DWR, I guess. But I don't know. <laughs> and they're still learning about rallies, but it's still a lot of times like now sometimes. You don't want to know how to do this, but. Mm. So I think it's about 12 minute video for the last one. So I'm going to leave you on the tripod guys for this last one. Um, and then I'm going to leave you guys with this train running around for you. Um, just get it adjusted. And I'm going to zoom in for you to, to enjoy the railway. I haven't done the tripod angle for a long time, so I know some of you guys liked it, but I know not everyone did, so it's understandable. The tripod angles are not always the best angles to get for a locomotive, but I'm going to leave her, I'll leave her at the top end, then, then you can see her running through. I'm not too worried about it, I know it's not wrong, but I don't even want to skin out of the river and doing some kind of work in the game. Some spacey house shows, so I'm not going to try that one.
see what lights are being up here. Uh, so we will have a garden and the lights are okay. This one, which is like, unusual, but it does happen at any corner. And you know, some of this track is second hand, being it. I'm not one to want to pay out quite a lot of money for the track. But, um, what I'm going to do in the future, I'll still get a second hand track, but um, I'll probably just, you know, make sure I've got balance and cork and underlay. And then make sure everything's planned out before I put my new track on. Because I want to make sure that the track is planned out before I put my new train on. Because I'll probably get quite a few new trends while I'm still here, but and then because obviously my birthday is in June, and you know on my birthday I'll probably get another locomotive to have for the lap. But at that point it'll be just at this stage, won't be anything fancy. But it'll basically be on the trains. There's no big scenery, but my layout is big. All right, this one is really big. At one time, you know, I was actually. Considered really going allowed, which sounded a little bit bigger than what I originally had. I didn't think we were getting some of this size, but what well, I'm spending money on food or trains? Definitely trains. I love my food, but I think for most of my life I could do a losing weight. You know, I got a bit of probably better at the moment. <laughs> I might be uh, so young, but even someone in the age of maybe 30 years old, well, like. Um, I'm going to hold the tripod while my Class 43 is running around without being so careful. <laughs> Crikey, this, this guy is a total state. My gosh. <laughs> I'm making some noises because, you know, the box is literally piled on top of each other right now. There's so much mess in this garage. There we go. <laughs> Close this layout angle I can get. So there we go. There's a car 43 just there. Only three ca two car carriages at the moment, so I will get some more fur, but obviously I think the track needs cleaning. But uh, yeah, let's just mostly focus on this side of the layout tonight, so that this bit here. Oh, you can see it coming down the layout. Yeah. 
took a little bit more time than the video tonight because there's uh, so much to do to go on now, tidying, picking things up. We should get ready for the spring and autumn. Just then smashing on, tidying this area up and basically it's all ready for the spring and spring and autumn. Return and we will probably be doing this for a while, doing this for a while, 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 coming, collect the table, for a fairly cheap price, I mean, I'll probably put it up for like, for an eighty, so I'm going to print this for a long time, for what it will do, and you can just have to do what you do, really. I'm going to go down on my corner and I'll get a photo of some going. I'm going to go down on my corner. It does go down on my corner a lot, so that's alright. Keep doing it. So my proper lab will be awesome, I hope. <laughs> I've got two boxes on it, two suitcases on it, two going out the way far, so I've got two sets of traps in that box. Stuff from 1980, stuff from uh, probably in the early, very early, well late 80s, early 90s, the yeah. year stuff. Maybe, maybe even the early 2000s, but I mean really early 2000s, like 2000, 2001, so yeah. That's off the photos for suitcases and we donate it away. Um, one set of the railway system, not this one, this stuff is this track and all these trains and carriages. Um, and all the things we're going to need. And including the locomotives, sheds and everything else can be in the track. This double O track I've got running on this table all the things we're going to need. The stuff in the suitcases are going to be donated away. So I'm going to put it in the way. So I'm going to put it in Thank you.